James was a high school three-star recruit at Duncanville High School in Texas. 42 passing touchdowns as a high school senior, and he goes down here. Lama Levea, 5 Webb. The freshman from St. Louis, Missouri, gets to James. Yeah, you know the first shove on the defense. Third and long for FIU. 22% this year on third down. Really struggling. Heavy pressure again. Nowhere to go for James. A host of Aggies. Ojo finishes it off. He was in the, in the uh, pattern, and he was looking for someone right down the middle there, but there was no room to go. He tried to step up in the pocket, but... Panthers will run on second down, trying to find the edges. Joseph, first down and more. He cuts it upfield. Lexington Joseph down near the one-yard line. His best run all year. They're com coming back with the same thing. It's a little zone or a little handoff. Quick sweep to the outside there. And everyone's just wide left open. Aggies stack up Joseph this time. A host of Aggies right there, including Keyshawn Elliott and Justin Segura. He's off the right hip of the sophomore quarterback, Grayson James, who's back to throw, has a man, it's caught. Tyrese Chambers for the touchdown for FIU. And he has enough time too, so not enough pressure, and he has enough time where he just threads it right between the middle there. What a drive for them. Chambers is an outstanding wide receiver. Short gain of two yards on the previous run for Frakes. This time he will hand it off to star Thomas. And Thomas has nowhere to go. He ran into one of his teammates initially. That was the first carry for Thomas, who had 11 carries for 144 a week ago. But there was also a ball that Gavin Frakes underthrew that would have led to a touchdown if he made a good throw. They pull it on the RPO. Catch is made by Bryce Childress. A good open field tackle for Demetrius Hill. Throw by Gavin. Let's watch it right here. So is the RPO. He pulls it out. There's a little uh, post pattern in the middle. Everyone is frozen, and it was wide open. And he did 29 yard line, fourth and four. Pistol back, Jamani Jones. Three receivers near side of the screen. Top side is Justice Powers. They throw it left, and it's hauled in. Eric Marsh. He had a couple of drops a week ago. Marsh collects his first catch of the year. Tomaz went for the tight end wing left. This is Jones trying to find a hole, trying to find an angle, trying to find something, and he's going to lose a yard or two there. Gavin Franks will hand it off to Thomas. Run straight up the middle. Touchdown, Thomas. The sixth Aggie rushing touchdown in the previous two games, and they get this one out of the eye formation. So first down and 10 from the 45-yard line for Grayson James in the FIU offense. James will throw across the middle, received again. Tyrese Chambers, those two guys on the same page right now offensively for FIU. And he throws it on second down, caught by Bracey. Bracey still on his feet, three Aggies chasing him. And Jalen Bracey might have snuck inside the pylon. He did. Touchdown, Panthers. Quick like others. Catch is made there by Ross Fournay, and he is met immediately. Big hit by Cyrus Dumas. James slings it out for Lexington. Joseph breaks a tackle, breaks another one. Joseph zooming down the far sideline. Catch and run for the score for Lexington. Joseph. Around the ball, and you can see it just quick pass right there. Get the ball out as fast as we can and let him do something with it. We miss one there. We miss one there. We can't get off a block there. That's really a miss. So there's three tackles right there that he ran past. Freshman tight end from Lubbock just came in the game. High formation look again. Full back is Marsh. Running back is Thomas. And Thomas barrels forward for the first down. He's still looking for his first passing touchdown this year. Does have two rushing scores, though. They both came in the same game against UTEP, and that was a botched play. He was looking left. Nobody was there. He was trying to hit it off to Jamani Jones, and Jamani wasn't there for it. Instead of going with four down linemen, they got three down linemen. They're sitting back with four backers. They're going to try to react in there. So a guy put in his helmet in there. Chris Ojo on the tackle for the Aggies. Tempo again for FIU. They 
They like to do this. This is typically what they do. We haven't seen it a lot. Bryce Jackson taking down Lexington Joseph from behind. And right now this offense for the Panthers, Danny, it's in a groove. Line is just getting up and getting in our face and pushing us back. So you look at right there, we got two blocks that are blocked down. And then uh, Chris just... Third and goal from the four. James to throw. Chris Ojo with the sack. And the Aggies push James all the way back near the 10-yard line. Gavin Frank started half one, played the entire first half. It's been Diego Pavia the entire way so far in half two. Pavia slipping away. He has nowhere to go. He was looking for a block from Star Thomas. Pavia has completed two passes so far, two for four for just 11 yards. Frakes was five for 13 for 54 in the first half. Pavia needs to throw it. He does. It's caught. Just as Powers finally able to reel one in. But let's see. Watch up front there. So first of all, there's four guys watch, uh, rushing. So we should be able to block them, but they're still putting pressure on Diego. He throws the ball, manages to get the ball out there, and Justice makes a great play. Number three, not number eight. So Kevin Boitman just had the wrong number on the announcement. So new set of downs for the FIU. E.J. Wilson, who is having a whale of a game, his best game all year. And you can see, look, play, there's just the same play they're going to this read. And so if everyone goes on, keeps, goes wide, he just hands the ball off and gets as many positive. Pavia swings it out. Cordell David running room down the far sideline. David zooming down the sideline. And he rumbles across the 40. Up screen pop outside, play action, get the ball to him as fast as we can, miss tackle, and he just takes it up to sidelines. Cordell can move too, so. That one goes for 23, so two catches for 28 yards now for the transfer from Trinity Valley Community College. The Aggie coaching staff feels like he has NFL potential. Jamani Jones into FIU territory. Good patience there from the Northeastern Oklahoma A&M Juco transfer. Field, look for the green, right? They always tell him, find the green, find the green. Where's the green? It's off to your right. It's our left on the screen. He finds it and gets great positive yards in there. Pavia under heavy front side pressure, and he stays on his feet. How did he do that? He throws a pass, and it's incomplete. Panthers three for eight on third down. James will throw. It is tipped and then caught. Chambers off the tip. Bryce Jackson got his paw on it. And the Panthers catch a huge break.